Businessman Perry Johnson, you may remember who ran for governor last year, is throwing his hat into the biggest political ring of them all, a run for president. Johnson will be running ads in Iowa, which will remain a first in the nation caucus for the GOP. Grant Herms spoke to Johnson today. Grant, he's got a new book and he says he's ready to run. Kimberly, he certainly does. He'll be airing these ads during the Super Bowl, which is how he made his announcement for governor here just last year. Now, he says he's got this plan that he wanted to introduce in Michigan, but now he wants to spread that across the country. Michigan millionaire and failed candidate for governor setting his sights on the White House. Perry Johnson is running nearly $200,000 worth of ads during the Super Bowl in three Iowa TV markets. In an interview Friday from his office in Troy, Johnson explaining his choice. Well, we know the Democrats have kind of given the middle finger to Iowa, but we know for the Republicans, that's where everything starts. And that's the beginning of the Republican caucuses. And I'm going to start everything there. Johnson, who made his name as a quality guru, was disqualified from running for governor last year after it was discovered his campaign had filed forged signatures to make the ballot. He says he's not worried that would follow him in a presidential campaign. No, not really. As a matter of fact, in reality, the candidates have very little to do with any of this. You hire a consultant, they go out and they get the petitioners. And then there's the expected field of candidates in a GOP primary. Former Governor Nikki Haley, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, who is expected to announce soon, and of course, former President Donald Trump. But despite that, Johnson thinks he has an edge. Well, I think I'm the only one that does have a plan. Uh, do they have a plan to solve this problem? My two cents to save America gives you a detailed plan of exactly what we're going to do to get back on track. Now, we also learned late this afternoon that Johnson will continue to buy ads in Iowa and New Hampshire through March 3rd. That will make him the leading spender in the presidential primary so far. In Detroit, Grant Herms, Local 4. Okay, we'll be watching it. Grant, we appreciate it.